Last minute preparations are underway here in Midtown. I'm Coco Dominguez. It is the sixth annual Latino Film Festival. Five days of festival where you get a chance to feature and really check out the genre, the themes of Hispanic filmmaking. Dave Sebrero, what does this say about the Latinos and their hunger? Yeah, I think we're witnessing it right now, right? Like we just seen Westside um, and all these big giant uh, Hollywood films that are being made. And I think, you know, film festivals like ours have a little bit of uh, influence on those decisions. They're finding out that, you know, we are feeling in the theaters and people are going out to watch these films. And you guys just partnered up with HBO Max. Congratulations, giving the viewer, the person, an opportunity to submit their film. Tell me about that. That's correct. So we're joining HBO Max, who um, are including six other film festivals, or Latino film festivals, I should say. And it's a contest where um, we select the best short films, and one winner gets to be on HBO Max. Um, so that's pretty exciting. And that contest is going out right now. People have a chance to submit. Yeah, um, if you go to our Film Freeway page, you can submit your work there. Just make sure you read the guides and regulations, and you'll be considered for it. And for the next five days, you've got so many films from all over the world here at Match to show. You've got four theaters. Tell me how it's going to work. We have over 80 films, uh, feature narratives, all kinds of genres. And we have filmmakers coming in from all over the world. Wednesday, we have Parsley, a Dominican film, and the filmmaker Jose Maria Cabral will be here. And so you can pay per film, you can have all access, then you have even more events. That's correct. So our single tickets are $12, or you can buy an all-inclusive, all-access badge, um, and you can watch all of the films, um, access our workshops, and our event party. Are you noticing that more people are taking advantage of making their own films without waiting for the big equipment? They're just going for it. Absolutely. Um, we're living in a time right now where, you know, filmmaking equipment is more accessible than ever. Um, so yeah, absolutely. Um, we're going to have Houston films. You're going to see some of that, some of those choices. Films here. Definitely take advantage. It is happening March 23rd through the 27th here in Midtown at the match. I will put a link on our website. I'm Coco Dominguez reporting Fox 26 News.